I'm Naomi Rogers and I'll be showing you around Campus Central. The reception is home to student services which help you with funding, accommodation and any form of transport problems. The reception also includes a library up above two floors. I'm Savannah and I'm going to be showing you around the Union. This is the Union building where students can hang out with their friends and play pool and ping pong in their free time. Um, I manage the Union building um, and I run activities um, throughout the year. So like this week we have Freshers' Fair, um, so I organised all that, liaising with all external and internal agencies, selling marketing space on the website, Twitter feeds, Facebook. Um, I do the student bulletin, which we also sell slots in, that I email out to all students. I organise alongside my colleagues the Student Star Awards that are held once a year. Um, basically any opportunity that I can liaise with anyone externally to pull money in for the student union. That's my job, I support the student union, I um, am C card coordinator for the SAI, I do, I'm the first port of call if anyone's got any worries, they come and see me. Everything non-academic and then some. It's never dull. <laughs> and I like working with you guys to be fair. Students are uh, great fun, tiring sometimes but no, it's good, it's varied and like I said, a great staff team here. Hi, I'm Liam O'Hare and I'll be showing you around the Panhalligan building which is home to higher education and A-levels. This is the Penhaligon building and there is a mock-up of a plane where people can train to be cabin crew. Why do you think the students from Cornwall College Campbell are so successful to get into higher education or the workplace? I think it's a combination of a lot of things. I think we've got some superb staff here that have done the job. So it's not just talking about it, they've actually done it out in the real world. We've got some superb facilities that we're upgrading all the time. So the, there's things that the students are working with. The equipment is at a level you'd expect to see in industry. So they're working with industry standard yeah. stuff all the way through, and specially built. So we've got actual buildings that are specific to that industry. We also work with a lot of employers. And so therefore, we actually know what employers are looking for. So we've actually filled the gap. And I think the most important thing is we've actually got students that want to learn. So we've got, we've got lecturers that are really enthusiastic, that are trying to put that enthusiasm over to students to really show them what it's about. Yeah. So it's not just the planned lesson, it's all the other things that go around that that actually makes it a whole experience for the students. Why do you think students choose, choose Cornwall College Campbell over other colleges? I think it's got a really good reputation for the things that it does. Yeah. Um, hopefully, and I think it's true is that we actually treat students as individuals. You're not just a number that actually appear on the day and you're that number you work all the way through. So I think you'll find that all your lecturers will know you as individuals. I think all the staff are approachable and therefore I think we build that mutual respect with students so that it's the staff students working together to get to the same thing. What made you choose this job over other jobs, other colleges? For me, it was the excitement of coming down here. I think it was. I came originally to head up hospitality, so yeah. that's what drew me away from uh, working in the Midlands. It's one of the biggest colleges in the country. It's got a superb reputation countrywide, nationwide, if you like. And to be part of that was really exciting. And for me, since I've come here, if you look around, it's looking at how this whole area has actually improved. So if you look on the site, the development that we're making in hospitality, for example, the £3 million new build, uh, the work that we're doing with DBS, and the whole regeneration of the area, I think we'll really start putting this area on the map. Okay, thank you.
Uh, I'm Keegan Pennington and I'll be showing you around the Tamar building, home to the media and arts production. This is the Tamar building, home to art and media. There are vending machines located all around the college, including this building on floor one. McDonald's? McDonald's. Mackey's, definitely. Uh, McDonald's. McDonald's. For me, I love it when all the new students come in and I can say to you to, you know, if you want to come into the shop, you don't have to buy anything. You, you know, you can use, if you need to use the phone or you want me to find anything. It's just making you all feel very welcome and know that there's somewhere you can come if you're like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. Um, getting a day off work. This, like, the camaraderie amongst the staff, okay, and there's a really good, like, working relationship between all the staff members and everyone's pulling together for the best for, the, for all the students. Sort of like being able to help students out with physical activity and also sort of helping them in their steps to get qualifications to become sports coaches and hopefully end up one day in a job like mine. Um, probably working with really lovely colleagues and the students we have who are really nice and of course the guys over in Arts and Media, they're amazing. Hey guys! Yeah. Liam, can you not? Clap your hands, you know, clap your hands. Wow, are you really all that depressed? <laughs> <laughs> I changed. 